Uh, Madison, of course, uh, says she's been studying the maps and has uh, ideas about some new places to scout, so that was it. Um, and, of course, with the, the coal in the nursery and that, you know, <coughs> it gets getting stuck with a bunch of cactus needles. Got too close to coal. Um, just one thing that went on there that we didn't mention before. Um, and then, of course, you know, when uh, he was trying to get the books for uh, Charlie, um, Luciana uh, knows how Charlie felt because that's how she felt at the Colonia. And she knows that Nick's way won't help her. Um, and Al asks how she knows that, and Luciana's like, uh, Charlie killed Nick, dummy. Duh. Yeah. And no, it's not going to work. Um, that was the sad part of that. Um, we find out John was a police officer. Um, he knew a guy on the force who actually used to drink a bottle of whiskey every night. Um, and that, But after a close call, everything changed. John says that it takes more than that. To change, and he guesses that Morgan will leave as soon as they bury Nick, which he did plan. Um, so um, he tells John he's going to find the woman he's looking for. Um, he wants her to meet them. Morgan admits he's going to leave once he's buried. He's better off alone, of course. Um, And, of course, the story about the water park. Um, let's see. Um, and, of course, the water slide. Um, they um, And at the top of the water slide, they find... Uh, it was full of weapons and coolers. Um, but one of the infected, one of the walkers popped out. That was pretty funny. I thought it was funny. Um, and Naomi falls backward, of course, into the giant toilet slide, woo, where, of course, the walkers are gathered. Um, other than that, um, pretty much, we pretty much covered. Um, this episode, like I said, it didn't grab me as much as I was hoping it was going to. Um, that moment where Morgan puts, puts the um, the flower on Nick's grave was uh, a moment for sure. Uh, that blue bonnet flower. Um, Um, let's see. Luciana has thought about leaving also. Of course they all did. Um, she tells Nick they have to go, but they keep, but he keeps looking, of course, at the library. Uh, they find, uh, Walker tied up with a bunch of bloody books. Um, and once, of course, he's dead, Nick sees that he has cut his wrists. Um, she and Nick argue about staying, of course, in the area. Um, and, of course, they use up uh, at the stadium. They've used up most of the condiments to cover the taste of the food that they don't want to eat. Um <laughs> yeah, He thinks they've... Um, Mel waves at her, and, uh, well, this is Madison works on her maps. Um, she's looking for people to come back. Mel, Mel waves at her from his, his spot there and points to the radio. And, of course, she calls him, and he asks her for some relish. <laughs> uh, that was a moment I'm like, wow, uh, <laughs> that was gutsy. Um, just a little um, irritant to irritate her, probably. Um, 
and he thinks they used up the condiments already because they mask uh, the taste of what they don't want to eat, of course. Um, and he also mentions your people might not come back. Uh, and, of course, the story goes on. Um, and she's still saying, you know, um, they can all live peacefully. Here we go. Da-da-da-da-da, yada yada yada. Um Al realizes this day was important because it was the day, it marks the day they all kind of decided to uh, leave the stadium. Okay. Um, Naomi tells Alicia about her time at the ER and ICU. She knows how you can uh, tell who will last. She insists that they talk to Madison because this won't last. Um, Strand says Al is wrong about that day. That's not how it happened. So, um, uh, you know, Madison runs out to find Cole in an empty car. The gate opens. Strand drives in, of course, with the supplies. Um, Al asks him, why, why'd you come back? Um, and of course, we went over that, that he had a reminder of what, you know, of what um, he could lose again. So, um, Al presses from, uh, Alicia finds Madison, says they need to talk. She brings Naomi back. Madison likes the new car, yada, yada. Naomi says they need to build an infirmary. Al presses for more info, and they all reveal they should have left. They should have done what they uh, what they were going to do instead of going back to the stadium. Um, if they had, Nick would still be alive. There you go. Al puts down the uh, camera and just kind of, you know, yeah. Um, uh, they pull over, of course, and bury Nick. Um, they have a map of where Ennis was going. Um, Alicia says they still have a lot of story to tell. Uh, Strand, Strand says that this is a chance to see how this ends. Um, Al tells them to load it all up. Morgan wants to know what they're going to do with Nick. Um, you know, Morgan proposes a better spot since, you know, Nick liked growing things. Uh, of course, they bury him under a tree. And, of course, Morgan and his blue bonnets. So sad. That was so nice. And then, of course, the big Laura reveal. Um, John doesn't believe, of course, that uh, Naomi Laura is dead. Um, we don't know if she is or not at this point. I don't know if she is or not, is she? Um, Morgan, of course, tries to talk to him, but uh, psh, he needs a bit of a, uh, he needs a few minutes there. <coughs> Excuse me. Al says she'll find out what happened. Uh, she promises to come back for him. And Morgan stays with him. Of course, the SWAT van dries off, leaving the two men on the road uh, in the middle of the night. That was um, kind of a little bizarre, but okay. Uh, Morgan tells John he's sorry for his loss. Um, Morgan And John says Morgan was right and that they're always on their own. So what's going to happen next? Is Naomi still alive? Do we know... For sure that she's dead. Not that I know of. Um, so like I said. The two highlights for me in this episode. Was the Walker Water Park. And. Um, and the big Laura reveal. So that was. Uh, the two big moments for me. Madison. Uh, come on now. Oh, if the offer still stands. We can live in peace. Does she really think that's going to happen? Honestly. Um, duh. No. Uh, to me, that's common sense. It's not going to work. Why would you even even con consider that? So do you think they should have gone on? Should they have gone back to the stadium? What do you think? Should they have just all left? Or uh, um, I should say, uh, how do I put this? Should they have gone back to the stadium or left? What what's your opinion opinion on that?
or just left. Like they were all going to. I don't know. Um, you know, hindsight's twenty twenty. You could say, oh, if we hadn't have done this, um, Nick would be alive. None of this would, you know, uh, would be happening. Is true or not? You never know. Things happen for a reason, right? Uh, we don't know for sure. If they had, if they had all left, maybe they would all been scattered. Um, they wouldn't have been a group. Some people would have been left at the stadium, and the vultures would have probably moved in and killed them all. So, uh, six and one half dozen the other. Uh, shoulda, coulda, woulda. But I, I don't know. Um, as it is, they all went back to the stadium. Um, to have some new supplies, a uh, few things anyway. So, um, what do you, where do you think they're going to go? What's the next step for them? I'm typing again, so. So what's the next step for them? Where will they go? I don't think they have, um, they should leave. I think they should leave, honestly. Um, and them going after the vultures, a few of them are really going to take them all on. Uh, we shall see what we shall see. Should be interesting next week. Um, so, you know, give me some input, what you thought of the questions. You know, what's the next step? Where will they go? Um, what was your favorite? Um, how hard was it for you to watch Nick uh, full of life after his death? Um, what did you think of the big Laura reveal? Uh, and your thoughts on the Walker Water Park? Um, and all in all, what was your opinion of this episode? Like I said, there was only two highlights, uh, for me. Um, and of course the moment with Morgan, uh, he's such a sweetheart. Um, yeah, that was a nice moment with him, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know where this is going. Um, I have mixed feelings about uh, this episode. I really do. There were some highlights for me. But mostly, you know, uh, I don't know. The, like I said, uh, some of the characters, they just don't grab me um, like on other shows. So um, I will plod through this. Um, I hope it gets, a, you know, I, I was a little disappointed with this one. Almost boring for me. But um, like I said, it had some good points. So not all bad, not all bad, I admit it. Uh <laughs> Um, as most of you know, um, after I couldn't even get through season two and I didn't even watch season three. So I am working on season three, so we shall see. Uh, they did step it up some, which I'm, you know, was told. Thank you, Rick. And, um, I was happy to see that, but in the first three episodes so far this year, uh, very good. Very good. This one, <laughs> I had some issues with it, but it, that's me. Um, it really has to get a hold of me, and uh, this episode just didn't do it for me. Um, just the two things, <laughs> and when that walker popped up, you know, um, at the top of the slide, that was pretty funny, I thought. Uh, so they, they did have some good moments. So, but all in all, there you go. Uh, so what's John going to do? Um, wow, what a shock for him! Uh, she wasn't all that far, um, as it turns out. So. He was closer than he thought to her. Um, but my big question, another question I have is, of course, why did he not notice anything about her? Uh, that he lived with this woman. Come on. Um, you didn't notice anything that would have, uh, you know, sparked a, a light on in him. Said, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Who are you? Um, did she change her looks that much? Um, I, I, this, I have a hard time with this. Maybe we'll find out some more about that. Um, of course, he hasn't seen Naomi or Laura. So, I'm, you know, again, I'm not sure because um, they said she died. So, but did she really? We don't know for sure, I don't think. So, and I answered my own question, didn't I? Uh, because he didn't see her. Because I would have thought if he saw her, he would have known. Uh, so, that's right. Duh. Silly me, I know. Um, so, <laughs> had to think that one through there for a second. Uh, but, uh, if you haven't watched it, please do. Um, I know there's a lot of fear fans out there and you guys love this show. Um, so far so good this season. Well, don't work too hard. 